are you stuck in a low-paying job going nowhere? You'd like a good job, you say, but you're so unskilled and uneducated that you don't even know what a good job is? Hi, I'm Don Mayer, and for just one cent, that's right, the cost of an ordinary book of matches, I can direct you to top money-making professional careers that you probably didn't even know existed. Why, you could be an industrial plumbing investment counselor. That's right, a lot of people are investing big bucks in industrial plumbing, and they may need your advice. And who do you think cooks the meals when systems analysts get together to negotiate their big contracts? You could, as a systems analyst arbitration chef. What, don't feel qualified, you say? Then work and learn at the same time as an administrative assistant production apprentice trainee. Yes, you'll train on the job with top apprentices learning to be assistants to production administrators. There are also career openings in electrical claims adjusting, TV repairman therapy, and aircraft refrigeration nursing. And if none of these interest you, then why not take a look at the fast-paced, big-money world of matchbook advertising? I did, and I'm rich. So next time you buy a pack of matches, don't just sit around picking your teeth with it. Fill out this handy order form and mail it to me, because there could be a job there for you. And now, kids, here he is, Mr. Science. Mr. Science, Mr. Science. Ah, I swear she was only 16. That's what she said. I, I'm in this. Ah, ah, what do you want? Ah, it's Donald. <laughs> Are you going to teach us something today, Mr. Science? That's right. That's right. Uh, we're going to learn uh, today to make coffee. Go over there. Over there. Why coffee? Never mind why coffee. Just do it. Now, uh, you put the kettle on there and turn it on, and it boils. You know why it boils? No. Because it's hot. That's why. Now, come on over here. <laughs> now, you got a cigarette? No. I got one here, never mind. Here's another experiment. This is uh, combustion, sit down. Now, see this is a lighter? See that? Now, I light it. Mm. And that end gets hot, and that's combustion. And you suck it in your lungs. You know where your lungs are? You do? I know where one of mine is. It's in a hospital in a jar. Never mind that. All right. Where's my coffee? Come on, hurry up, hurry up. Eddie, you got to move faster than that. You know that. Now, look. If scientists fooled around all the time, where would we be today? In a cave. Wouldn't be such a bad idea, either. Living in a cave with it. Come on, hurry up, will you? You're never going to make it, you know that. Come here. It's good. Oh, that's good coffee. You're learning, you know that? You're a bright kid. But you know what? Mr. Science is very tired, so why don't you get lost? But, but you promised to teach us something. That's right, I did, and I keep my promises, don't I? So yeah. turn on the TV, we'll learn about TV. <laughs> Smart ass. Well, it's in dislike. Freud Isn't that funny? <laughs> That's smart, isn't it? Freud presented Ibsen with a, a whopping bill. I don't know why you get colors, because there's scanners in there. Use your head. You gotta learn to use your head. Later tonight on SCTV, a small child bugs his father on shock. <laughs> <laughs>